What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. Um, yeah, this is uh, this is another episode of the uh, the Zelos forty eight gas powered boat here. But um, you fix the camera here. Uh, I know that uh, I released some footage before where uh, the link is in the description. If you haven't seen it yet, uh, there's an unboxing video. The description's below, and also um, I took this boat out. Uh, I, I called it episode two. And I actually did not show the footage of my boat in the water in episode two. So my apologies for that. I'm going to release that footage. Uh, I was going to do it this weekend. But the thing is, um, I'm flying out to Texas. I'm going to uh, meet some family. My wife is there right now with my kids. Uh, she's visiting her family. And um, I wanted to put out a video. This is a quick video. This is a, I need to do some maintenance here before I leave because I took it, uh, took it to the lake, broke into the engine. But I need to, of course take this out to show you guys how um i grease up the, the shaft um i wanted to do, to do that before i leave on my trip for sure it's uh it's thursday night i'm sorry it's wednesday night right now i i, I go to work tomorrow and then i basically fly out from lax and um and uh, yeah, yeah but be be uh be expecting a video the the, the actual running video which uh <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because I have a, a you know episode one, I have episode two, and you guys have not even seen it run yet. Um, but uh, I'll release that. I promise. I, I I will release that footage when I come back from some, sometime next week. But right now, I want to do this quick video of some maintenance work that needs to be done. Um, it should be done periodically when you take it into the water because of the rust, you know, the shaft. And so this is what I use here. Um, some of the guys were recommending other things. Some of the guys at the lake. And one of the guys recommended this. It, you can basically, it's endless possibilities. You can use whatever you want as long as it's thick marine grease. So I'm going to use this. And uh, here, I'm not sure if you guys can see, but you basically take this off right here. You unscrew this, and then this thing pops out like that. So I kind of pre, uh, pre -loose, made, made this thing loose, and then... I'm taking it out, and then it comes out of here, of course. This is the clutch. Oh, you know what? A lot of the guys were saying take the clutch out. I like the clutch, guys. I, it, You know, again, when I release the footage, you guys will see uh, this boat in action. So I can't wait for you guys to see that. Just so um, uh, that, that'll be next week. But the clutch is cool because you can just let the boat idle for a little bit. You know, it just idles. And of course, you don't want to let it idle too long. You know, you don't want the, the, the engine to get hot. You know, you, you, the water goes in through here and it cools the head right here. And then you have another section here where it also cools. And that is right here. This whole, it's right there. So water goes in there and it comes in through this hose here. And it goes into this little block that's in here and cools the engine. So, pretty simple setup. I like it. I'm learning it. But the clutch, it's not going to go. It's going to stay there. I'm going to have, uh, I'm going to basically upgrade the pipe. I'm going to go through my friend Chris Bartolone, fix this here. And I might mod the engine a little bit. But for being a 30cc, it's pretty, it's pretty nice, pretty decent. So, yeah, let me uh, go ahead and change this here so you guys can see hopefully you guys got a good view there take this off but yeah like i was saying texas is gonna be a, a nice little relaxing trip i've been wanting to get out for a, for a while uh they have a lake out there actually um but how the heck do you take one of these in the, on the plane Oh, and by the way, if you guys have any idea or or, or any suggestions on, on when you travel with a gas powered, how do you how do you move a gas powered vehicle? They're not allowed on planes. So please comment down below. Let me know if you guys have any ideas what to do. My only idea was basically pay the money and UPS it <laughs> on ground. Obviously you can't go to like a different country, but but at least if it's something domestic. So it, please I want to see what you guys say in the comment section. And uh, so here comes this. I'm try to get this all stuck in there. Okay. There you go. 
See, it's still, it's still full of, uh, it, the, the grease looks like it's coming off. So I'm just going to re-apply uh, some of this grease on there. I think I have a towel around here. Let's see here. Anyway, what do you guys think? Again, comment down below. See what you guys think of, of the boat. Well, the boat that you have not even seen run yet. <laughs> but uh, but uh, you'll see it. I have the footage. I have like 20 minutes of footage on that. Uh, to be honest with you, I was super excited. Just like, you know, like riding this thing. And I had my wife try to film me. And, and uh, it was a fun day, by the way. A really fun day. All right. So you get some of this bad boy. Um, when you try this, do it with gloves on, okay? Do it with gloves on. I'm gonna hold a bunch of grease on this bad boy. Yeah, I just don't want to go on a little vacation and have the you know things start rusting because I basically in my garage like there's windows in my garage and the, the sun just like beats in here. Um, but I thought I, th I think it was gonna be raining this weekend, so there you go. As I give you a, a look of this now, here's another deal. I wanted to kind of mention this that. Some, this here, the only complaint that I have on this boat is you see this shaft. I don't know what you want to call this, but the shaft goes in here. This pole needs to be up to where the bottom of the hole is right there. Now, I asked why, and somebody just told me it's physics. <laughs> it's a great explanation. I mean, I don't know why. But it, my boat was running okay. It was, it was fine. But some of the guys were saying that this here needs to be up maybe half inch to right there. And, it, and that reminds me. This here. The auto bailers don't like. Don't like. Uh, these things, basically, it's a ball bearing that's inside of here, if you guys don't know. And basically, they keep the water out of the hole here. And that's one of them right there. You can see this one. And there's another one on this side, it's kind of hard to see. So those guys, this one and then this one over here, okay. See, they're supposed to keep the ocean or, you know, the, the lake water to, from coming inside the hole because the, the ball's on the outside. And then inside is a piece of rubber and the water basically when it gets inside of here, uh, it it shoots out because of the pressure when you're when you're like, when you're going right uh, with with picks up because of the momentum in, in the in the on the boat it'll go back out that's cool it's a great idea however when you're when you have the boat sitting in uh, idle like sometimes i just like to have the boat just chilling on the pool or whatever it'll start to leak in so within five minutes the, the the water is up to the to the servos i i don't like that so i'm actually going to take those out you know i'm gonna just i'm gonna take these bad boys out and then just seal it. And and that, 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 so between this and this, I think those two are my, just my, my only complaints. And of course, um, everything else I love about the boat. The engine needs a little bit of souping up and we're good, it's, it's a beautiful boat. But anyway, if you guys love this video you like the video you like the information please subscribe to the channel and and of course I'm, like i said earlier i'm going to release the, finally the footage of the, of the running uh, uh video and if you guys have any ideas any suggestions of anything anything you guys want to see subscribe to my channel and uh and then you know hit the bell button so you guys get notifications of when i release videos and i'll make more videos so um have a good night and i'll see you after texas